guys, John here with Realtruck.com. Today I'm going to show you how to install the Kurt front mount receiver hitch on this 2015 GMC Sierra Denali 2500. Alright guys, we've got our hitch out of the box. You can see here, it comes with everything you need to install this on the truck. It comes of course with your receiver hitch, your instruction sheet, and your hardware for mounting this on there. So let's get this on the truck. First thing we have to do here, guys, is to remove this bolt right here. And we'll do that on both sides. And then uh, this bolt up here, we're just going to loosen this one a little bit, uh, just so that way we can kind of move stuff around a little if we need to. We've got this bolt out down here, so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our fish wire and we're going to put our plate on it and our carriage bolt and then we're going to attach it on here just like this and uh, what that's going to do is that's going to allow us to be able to fish this through a hole up here and we're going to run it up through the frame here and what we want to do is we want to bring it out this hole right here all right, we've got this slip through where it's going to go, so we can go ahead and grab a hold of that and pull it, and at the same time, fish our bolt and stuff along through here. And what we want to do then is pull it up in place, just like so, and uh, leave this wire on it until we get uh, ready to actually put the, the hitch in place. So what we're going to do now then is we're going to go ahead and go over to the other side and do the same thing over there and then we'll be ready to show you guys how to put the hitch up on the truck. Alright guys, so what we're going to do now then is we're going to take our wire that we use to fish our bolts through and we're going to pull it through the slots on the sides of our hitch and then just go ahead and push the bolt back inside a little bit because we'll have this wire on here to pull it back in place and uh, the reason why we're doing that is because I'll show you here in a minute this fits pretty snug up against the frame rail and with the bolt sticking out we won't be able to get this up in place so we need to push that bolt back through a little. Once those bolts are pushed back in then what we'll do is just get our hitch lined up here and uh, you can do this by hand it's, if you got help it's a lot, uh, a lot easier and uh, or if you have something like this or you, you could do it on the ground actually and just use a, a floor jack or something to uh, get this up in place. We've pulled our bolt through. We'll go ahead and put the nut on it and you want to kind of lightly do this guys so you don't knock that thing back down inside there again and uh, get that started. And once that's started and held in place then what we can do then is go ahead and go over and do the other side the same way as we did this side. Okay once we have these nuts on these bolts and everything is, is held up here in place then we can go ahead and replace the ones we took out of here and once we do that then we can go ahead and tighten everything back up. Alright guys, there you go. That's how quick and easy it is to install the Kurt front mount receiver hitch on your truck. Now something to keep in mind is this is a 2 inch receiver hitch and it can hold 500 pounds of tongue weight and 5,000 pounds of pole. So there you have it. Until next time, happy motoring.